Hi, I'm Megan Taft, Physical Therapist of Revolutions in Fitness. This is your tri-tip of the week. We're going to do a postural exercise against the wall, so trying to utilize all of your back muscles, the back of the neck, back of the shoulders. So this will be beneficial for your swim, bike, and your run. You're going to start against the wall, walk your feet out just a little bit, uh, a little bit further away, bend your knees just a hair, and then you're going to be slightly flexed at your hips, so just your sacrum bone against the, uh, against the wall. And then from there, you're gonna slowly start to round your back and work each individual vertebrae up the wall, pressing each segment into the wall, tightening your core as you go along. The goal being eventually getting the entire spine from the low back, also all the way up to the neck, uh, flush against the wall. Once you're there, you should feel all the core muscles tensing, tightening, even in through the neck. And then from there, you're going to shrug your shoulders Flip your palms, squeeze your shoulder blades, and then drop them down. So now in addition to all the spine and postural muscles that are contracting, you also have your rotator cuff and your shoulder blades activated at the same time. Once you have this posture against the wall, you're gonna hold that for about 30 seconds initially, and you can work up to doing about a minute uh, once all is said and done. But you're just holding this posture, breathing normally, uh, never holding your breath, making sure your feet and your legs are relaxed so that it's only coming from the core, the spine, and the shoulder, shoulder blade region. And then after 30 seconds, relax. So again, strengthening all the muscles on the back side. So that's gonna help you in aero position on the bike. That's gonna help your running gait form and that's gonna help your swim stroke. That's your tri-tip of the week.